Hey, what's up guys? We're back with another unboxing review. Today we have the Lightning Connector Kit. I bought this from Amazon for $10. And I bought this, I'm sure you guys saw with the iPad review. It's the my um, USB with the Lightning adapter. And I was searching because I need a micro SD one. But the Apple one didn't work. So I went on Amazon, bought this one, and let's check it out. It has no tape on the back. This is the back of it. It says cameras for the USB, keyboard, you can connect the phone to charge up while you're doing it. And then the iPad connects to there. Um, we have micro SD, SD, and all kinds of those adapters right here. It's called the Card Reader Plus Hub. Works on iOS 9. All the information here is iPad Air, iPad 4, iPad Mini 4, and iPad Mini 2. Lightning Connector Kit for $10. And this is the Apple one. Right, so this is the box. We don't need that. And then this is what it comes with. So another plastic on top. And then this is the box. The hub, what they call. And then an AC adapter for when... So it can, it's like the lightning assist in the Apple one. But... AC adapter assist. So I'm guessing you plug that into there, right here, right there, and then plug this into your iPad. Let me get the iPad. Oh. All right. So you plug it in with the iPad down here, and then see red light turns on. That indicates that it's connected. If I were to grab a SD card. I'm pretty sure. Um, yeah, let's try without the assist, the power assist first. I'm guessing this would go right here. This. All right. All right. This is probably an M. Wait. All right. No. Let's exit out of that. Here, let's see if we have a flash drive that has something on it. This is a USB. See if any of that works. And if not, then I'll just plug it in with the adapter. All right, so I'm going to plug it in because it's obviously not working. All right, so I got my power brick. I'm sure you guys saw it in the iPad Air video. And then this is the wire. Get this out like that. Okay, perfect. I like keeping these. So I'll just wrap that right back around in there. Okay. We'll plug it in through here. I will plug in USB there. And we're going to walk over to the outlet. Over here. The outlet. Pretty sure it's working. Yep, red light stayed on, so it's still working pretty well. Plug that in right there, and I'm pretty sure this USB drive has um, some pictures on it. And if not, that's fine. I have others. All right, so that obviously is an empty USB drive. So I have. Let's see. Some other micro SDs. All right, let's see right here. Replug it in. All right, so it looks pretty much as if my all of my SD cards and thumb drives are actually empty. So this is, I'm sure you guys get get like what. Sure you guys know what it's supposed to look like when you guys and um, plug whatever you want into it. We have three USBs, micro SD, SD, M2, and then a T flash. So that's pretty much it, guys. If you guys, if you guys purchase 
the lightning connection kit be sure to know that it's the hub and the wire if you guys don't have that close it back up send it back and that's pretty much it so you get the import screen only works for iPads keep that in mind not iPhones or any other Apple device with the 30 pin con er, with the lightning connector so um I'd highly suggest it over the Apple one because Apple is ripping you off for 40 bucks. I bought this for $10 and it does everything plus all the other $30 adapters Apple has out there for you. So for 10 bucks on Amazon, it works amazing. It can add a 45, 45 minute video uploaded it in one minute to my iPad. I have all that footage on my camera. But um, that's pretty much it guys. Be sure to look out for the white DC adapter in the um, hub. All right, so it turns out, I actually, re I'm recording on my iPhone right now, and I actually was able to take my camera out. So this is, my camera has the data, but this is the USB hu hub from the first one. Plug it in. And it says, USB mode, mass storage. So now, if you come in and you'll see, I have it's all connected and this actually has memory which was the unboxing I'm gonna click import all look at it you saw how fast it connected and then I'm gonna import only two of them watch at this one I'm gonna click stop import just about when that one stops and I'm gonna show you the Apple one so once that one down gives me the checks then I'll be set and I will use the Apple. Okay, so stop import. Whew. Delete whatever's on the computer. Now I'm gonna unplug that one. And now we're gonna try the Apple one. So for the Apple one, you're gonna need the lightning connector. Plug that into the wall. Right there. Plug this right in. Let me X out of that. Plug this right into the bottom of your iPad. And then plug your USB into the USB. Whew. Okay, so now it's doing the same exact thing. Import all. Skip duplicates. And that's what the before is. Now, I'm showing you guys. This worked absolutely the same way. They probably, like I would say, connected the same time. But that's not the point. My point is... You for ten dollars you get three USBs, one mic or one micro SD, one T flash SD, which I have no idea what that is, but that's another one. You have the SD, which is for all cameras, and then uh, at, um, it's called SD or MS Duo. I'll delete over there. Delete all. All right, and for ten dollars. Over $40, which is this USB, I'd definitely go with this one. So before you guys check out or go to Apple, please look into this one. I'm, they're not telling me to sell this or anything, but I'm highly suggesting this one over anything. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I got the memory from this one all set up. And yeah, thanks for watching. Please hit that like and subscribe button and stay tuned for more videos. Thank you.